Welcome to the weekly update. Reminder, there is no school on Monday, June 19th as we pause to recognize and celebrate Juneteenth. As we head into next week, there are only three student days of school left. From field days, moving up ceremonies, prom, and graduation of our seniors, there's a lot to look forward to as we wrap up the school year. Speaking of seniors, it was great to see them participate in our first memory walk. Seniors from Williamsville East, North, and South returned to their elementary schools and shared what they're doing next, whether it's entering the workforce, joining the military, or heading off to college. And they had the chance to see their former teachers. This was an incredible event. Be sure to check out the highlight videos in the weekly newsletter and on social media from all six of our elementary schools to see the joy and excitement of this event. Governor Kathy Hochul shared a special message with the class of 2023. You can watch her video in the district and high school weekly newsletters. This week for Pride Month, we highlighted Marsha P. Johnson, a black transgender activist. Marsha participated in the Stonewall Uprising and surrounding activism that sparked the LGBTQ plus movement in 1969. The P in her name stood for Pay It No Mind. This was her life motto and her response when people asked questions about her gender. In the 1970s, Marsha rose to prominence as an advocate for homeless LGBTQ plus youth, those affected by HIV and AIDS, and gay and transgender rights. In 1975, Andy Warhol featured Marsha and 13 others in his Ladies and Gentlemen print series, highlighting the New York transgender community. Learn more about Marsha by watching the video project in the weekly newsletter. Don't forget, the next Board of Education meeting is scheduled for Wednesday, July 5th. It's the annual reorganizational meeting where a new president and vice president will be elected for the upcoming school year. We will also have the special education review presentation at that meeting. As a reminder, with local and regents exams, some middle and high school students may be in school if they have an exam. Middle school students have half days next week and elementary students have a half day on June 22nd. Enjoy the weekend, finish the year strong, and we'll see you next week.